a lot of custom rooms you might have tried on your devices and this one is something different which even does not have any kind of name yes you hear right it's nameless aosp but one of the best things what i liked about this one is it includes all those features and customizations for you but it doesn't look like if you move on to the settings options and you try to find some options for you you don't have a dedicated menu to enable all those customizations but all the customizations are present by the way this is of course based on the latest android version it's not based on android 12 actually it will give you the easter egg of android 12 for sure but it's actually based on android 12.1 you can see nameless aosp suite 12.1 I am using this official version in Redmi Note 10 Pro, available for Redmi Note 10 Pro Max also and some of the other devices and the devices which are supportive for this link is already available in the description. As I just said, it's based on Android 12.1, so all the Android 12.1 features or 12L features are already included, which was expected. We have the Pixel Launcher pre-installed and you can see this is looking perfectly fine so far as I am using it from some time, maybe approximately three days so far and this room definitely seems quite good if i move on to any other options for example the animations which you have in android 12.1 looks quite interesting the internet tile you just saw the power menu also has very cool and interesting animation for you other than else things are basically quite interesting if you move on to the safeness status of course it's not a device specific review by the way but still safeness status is also one of the major things to keep in mind and safeness status does not have any kind of issues here for me I've installed this room and I haven't rooted my device. So in my case, no issues in safeness status at all. If I move on to the settings option, let me show you if I move on to the apps and if I move on to the miscellaneous, you can see unlimited Google photo storage, which is actually available as an option. Looks quite interesting. And same with that, we have the normal, not normal one, sorry. We have an interesting game space available, which you have maybe in one custom room, which I just don't remember right now, but that custom room has this kind of game space available. That's available in this latest Android version also. Looks quite interesting. If you move on to the notification section, now we have the heads up related customization sorry heads up notification related customizations and in call vibration related options available here for you by the way some customization which i got here looks quite interesting some might not be battery also has some customizations where you can customize the battery icon style battery percentage and wipe the stats if you want to same with that if you move on to the sound section you have the screenshot sound per app volume control which of course matters a lot for some of the users and some of the other things are already included you can see the volume panel is also at the left side which you can enable or disable now moving on to the display settings where you have the network speed indicator options and here you have the quick settings brightness slider related customizations for you you can customize the brightness slider according to your own preference move to bottom if you want to you can use this at the top or whatever you want to use it quick setting tiles layout you can customize for example the number of rows and columns and sometimes these things are not available in these android 12 based custom rooms so far in a lot of custom rooms you don't have these features available but in this one we have this option and as i just mentioned at the starting of the video i haven't rooted my device so if you don't want to root your device but you can customize if you want to customize the quick settings panel icons and a lot more things then this room is a perfect choice for you you can move on to the other options like status bar customizations notification count we have the monet settings available which means custom monet and we have the fonts customizations we have the icon pack customizations where you have the archers pavlova ui whichever you want to choose it's up to you let me try to enable the pavlova ui right now and pavlova ui is one of the best ones out there one of the best themes or one of the best icon packs out there looks absolutely interesting if i move on to other options for example security face lock fingerprint lock app lock everything which was expected is already included system etc gestures quickly open camera swipe to screenshot and etc etc a lot of things are quite interesting and these were things i just want to let you know system update so far right now it's not working maybe because of the initial build but we'll see it in the upcoming updates everything else i've already showed you maybe you like this build if you want to install this thing link for official things available in the description this was all thanks for watching i will see you in the next video until then goodbye Over the edge, feel like I'm floating through